Welcome to another My Two Good Hands video. We're out in the RV and we're working on one of those things in the shower that every RVer hates but doesn't talk about shower spigots. Check it out. You know, you've got this where you try to turn it and put it in here and it always wants to turn up top. It doesn't want to aim at you. This is too rigid. We're going to uninstall this and show you what we've got and we're going to improve it. To take these out is pretty easy. You can grab this part here and turn this, break it loose, spick it off. Same thing down here. Turn it uh, counterclockwise and off it comes and out it comes. And you can see how this is not flexible. It's just terrible. Let's go show you what we got to replace it. So once you've got this stuff off, just set it aside. We'll get a screwdriver. We'll take the top piece off that holds it because it's loose and uh, we'll show you what we got. Make sure you throw a towel over your drain because when you take screws like this out, you don't want to lose them down the drain. Right, go ahead and take this off and then we'll show you what we've got. So here's what we bought. Got this off of Amazon. Uh, what's in here? There's the, uh, the sprayer with the connectors you put on. But look at how loose this is. Whee! Look at how loose that hangs. So we should be able to uh, install this. Uh, it's got a nice on off button. It also has uh, now three spray vo volumes so we can use our water wisely. So let's go put this in. Again, pretty easy to put together. If you look in here, there's a rubber O-ring. Make sure it's in there. Put this on. Just tighten it by hand. The uh, O-ring makes it seal nice. The other piece, got to drop through this hole, and it through, and you can see how nice this hangs, all right, look how nice that hangs. Then they put a uh, cover in here, so you got to take these out. They're threaded, you can't pry them out. Then this will go on this part here. Don't cross thread it. Well, it's hard to get started. But you got to get down here and get it started. Great. You'll know when you got it straight. You just tighten that up by hand. Don't want to break anything, so just do it by hand. Okay. Now we've got to go see about the uh, piece that goes up here to hold this. But look at how nice this is and how easy this will uh, be uh, nice and loose here. You don't have to fight it like the old one. We'll just put that right there, and we'll get the other. This new one came with two pieces. One piece you screw on, and the other piece uh, clips over it uh, like this. So you can see how that goes on. Uh, so you got this piece bracket that goes on the wall. This slides over it. So it has a much nicer, much nicer look there than the uh, than the old look. Uh, you can snap this in all the way. You don't want to snap it in all the way until you have your uh, this piece mounted. So I want to wipe that clean up there. Uh, this has a little adhesive back here, and we're going to go put that on. So what we're going to do is we're going to not line the holes up perfect because we want to uh, we want to have new holes. So we're going to put a little bit above, just like that. Make sure again this is nice and clean. Line that up. I'm going to put this on just like this. Now we're going to get those two screws we took out of the other one and we're going to put them into here. Okay, so the key here got us too long a drill bit, but that's what we got. The key here is just drill the plastic, okay? Do not drill the wood. Just like that. Kind of see how that popped away. That's all you need there. Now we can take the screws we removed before. Oh, 
the right screwdriver tip that fits in the screw. And you want to make sure your screws are tight, but not too tight. You don't want to strip them. If you use new screws, make sure they don't go through the wall the other side. Now that's up on there. Now we can take our other piece, which is this piece, which goes in here, slides down on here. Just like that. And slides nice like that and then this goes in here real nice and this has somewhat of a uh, holder so there you go showers installed we'll show you a look the beautiful thing here is this it's nice and flexible so no worries so here's our new shower you can see we got on and off here so that's nice uh push to stop so that is in the stop mode that's in the go mode also have uh three styles of spray so we can conserve water and you got a nice flexible hose in here so no more fighting this thing that'll be just great this is sealed up to the wall nice the water will get behind it uh perfect okay there you go we installed our shower head thanks for watching my two good hands don't forget to use the amazon link below we got this on amazon it was really inexpensive you can see how easy it was to put in and no more fighting that rubber hose. It's just going to be so much better. Everybody will love it, especially the women who have to shave their legs in here. They really like this flexibility. So don't forget to like and subscribe, post notifications on. Catch you in the next My Two Good Hands video.